Hi there, this is uh, Clint with Ag League Paper Shop. I'm just doing a quick uh, little tutorial here um, about the proper way of filling uh, Nautilus tanks. Uh, this is a 5 mil tank, but the minis, which is uh, only a 3 mil tank, they're, they act the same way. Um, you do the exact same thing with them. Anyways, we got it on an eye stick here, eye stick 20 watt. Anyway, you take it, oops, you take it off like this, okay? And then what you do is you hold the glass and then you there's this, the gripper on the bottom of the tank. You hold it upside down like this so that way the juice doesn't fall up. Anyways, you just grab and you twist to undo. Okay. Just keep on doing that. And it comes apart. Sometimes and this, the best way to do to deal with this is if you want to put this down, take your drip tip off, and then you can just set it on the table upside down like that. Just don't jar it or bump it and stuff like that, and she'll stay proper. Anyways, sometimes this coil here ends up coming out on the other piece, which is which it looks like that. Sometimes it's upside down like this, and it's sitting in here. Whenever that happens. Just you just uh, put or twist it. Do not twist up uh, or try to turn the little thing on top here. I don't know if you can see it. See the thing on top there? That just is loose on there. So if you go to twist that, if it's bound in here, you have to grab it by the ridge here. Because if you, you grab it by this piece here, it'll end up uh, just spitting it and nothing happens. So, anyways, you just unscrew it like that. And you put this down again. And then you take this again and you screw it into here, like so. And then just, um, like, two hand tight, two finger tight. You do not need to wrench on it. If you wrench on it, there's a good chance you'll end up uh, not be able to get back off. Anyways, so then you just simply take your tank, uh, fill it up on the outside between the the chimney, I call it the chimney, there's m multiple names for it, but I call it the chimney for the device. Between uh, the chimney and the glass, of course, so that it sits like that. Okay, and then when you're filling it for the very first time, and there's the coil is brand new, always take, I'm just going to use, for instance, this stuff here. I'm not going to put any name, but I'll show you what I'm doing. What you do is you just drop, drop about uh, eight or nine drops inside the coil. Um, if you notice inside, the, you, it's very hard to show, but inside there's a little hole there. Just try to get it, in, um, try to uh, put about four or five, or no, sorry, about seven or eight drops in there. And what happens is it, uh, the cotton inside that coil um, soaks up that e, that e-liquid. So then when you go to put it back together, and you, you know, again, always leave this upside down. Put this in here down through the center chamber and it screws on. Again, just just tight, uh, not tight, just just enough that as soon as you feel it start to uh, resistance, that's when you stop. There's a little seal on in there that will stop it from leaking. So see, it's not gonna leak at all. If you over tighten, you end up having to use pliers and then you end up destroying the coil or another piece of the tank. So all you need is just very, very like, I'm talking like a nine-year-old strength, a nine-year-old girl's strength, just to just to close it. That's all you need. You don't need to, these are small, very, very small connections and stuff in there, so you don't need to tighten it really bad because you'll just destroy it. Anyways, <clears throat> there you go. You have it back together again. Then, of course, on this one with a nice stick, this thing on the outside here is called a beauty ring, which just makes it seem makes it seem more flowing. It's more uh, not more flowing, but it just makes it look better. It's a beauty ring, right? And then, of course, then after that, you, you there's this ring on the outside here, which is your breather hole. It has multiple settings: one, two, three, four, from one millimeter up to three millimeters. And so you just set it to whichever you like. Then you check your check your device there and look. And, okay, you got 
on this one it's 1.7 ohm and you can go up to a maximum of 17.7 Then you just simply put it to your lips. There's a fire button. I always, I always find it better to blow first. Blow until you see vapor coming out of this, out of your vapor hole. So you go. And simple as that. That way, and I always do that because that way when you go to suck in, you're getting full vapor. You're not getting a bunch of air before while the, the coil's heating up and everything. All right? So that's it. Um, good luck, everybody. And um, let me know in comments below in the video here if you have any additional questions. All right? Thanks.